So thanks for coming to the YouTube channel. Now we're here to hear Sam's answer to the, if he has one, hopefully, <laughs> to the question, what sacrifices have you made in life? Uh, I mean, this can be big. This can be little. This can be whatever you. Um, I think the, my biggest sacrifices have been to do what I love to do, which is being involved in sports, mm -hmm. is the sacrifice of time with my family. Yeah. Um, and, and it started at a young age uh, when I was in uh, school and high school you know you get into season especially when you're a multi-sport athlete and you know you can see, you'll see your loved ones at holidays your grandparents and stuff but then when you get into high school and it's just there's so you're always doing something and it kind of pulls you away from those those relationships and I remember um you know I lost my grandma during a football game it was oh. actually we were playing Gibsonburg and it was a double overtime crazy game yeah. you know and you get done and you're so psyched you just had this great football game and then you got to hear that you're and then you start feeling guilty because you know you hadn't seen them in a little bit yeah. and they live down the road from you you know it's like that's not very big and uh so you know you kind of sacrifice that time but then you also know that they know how much you love what you're doing mm -hmm. and and um you know no different i lost my uncle we got done um went in the pit tournament um you know i can't remember what year it was but because we had won it a couple times, but when I was a head wrestling coach and my uncle had passed away yeah, and during the pit, you know, but nobody told me because we were focused on winning the tournament, yeah, you know, and then you hit, you know, now and I still, my family, um, you know, I sacrificed that time with them as much as I'm putting towards what I love to do with coaching and, and, and that kind of stuff. And so, yeah, I think that, that the biggest sacrifice I've, you know, is that time with my family. Yeah. That I, yeah. You know, it, it, but you bring a good point. Like it is a sacrifice, but they, you know, part of it is under, your family understanding. Like, like you love to do this stuff. Yeah. You know, if it's coaching, you know, now you're coaching your your daughter's t-ball team. Like yeah. all these things that that's good for it's good for the people you're coaching, but it's also good for you mentally, mm -hmm. like to to want to do all these things. Because I would imagine, you know, like if if. I would be upset like if something happened and I couldn't coach anymore. Yeah. Like man, that something a part of me is gone. You know, eventually yeah. I would find it somewhere else. Right. But it is a big part of you. And and I remember when my brother passed away, I uh, I tried to go to work and I couldn't. Uh, and then Coach Kriegel even said like, Hey, you know, we got we got practice this week. If you you know if you need time off or whatever. But I was sitting at home. I was like, you know, it's like you know, I, I know I need to go to football. Like, yeah. give me, you know, give get my thoughts away. All those, I know everyone there cares about me. You know, I want to be a part of this still. And, yeah. you mean, know, that's what you need. It's a huge, I mean, it, especially over the years, you can just see the difference. Like, you'll go through, like, a rough day, and it's really tough. And then you get to football practice, and it's like, then you get into, like, what you want to teach these kids. And yeah. You're going through that stuff, and it just takes your mind away from that kind yeah. of stuff. And, yeah, it is a great a great out, but yeah, yeah it does yeah. pull that time away. Yeah. Uh, but I, I guess my, my, my saving grace is that I know that those who, you know, whether it be my siblings or my parents or my, my wife or my kids, uh, my kids don't know yet cause they're too young, yeah. but you know, they know how much I love them. Mm -hmm. Um, but I also love what I'm doing. So during football season now, cause yeah. I don't coach wrestling anymore, but during football season, that time gets taken away a little bit and I'm yeah. super busy. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. Well, well, thanks, Sam. Thanks for uh, pulling a question out of the box. Um, it's uh, we never know what's going to come out of this box. So uh, <laughs> I'm, gl I'm glad you you had a, you had a great answer for that because that's I mean it lines up perfectly with, with how I think too, and, and probably what most people think as far as when you're when you're coaching because no. there's a lot of time. So uh, thanks for coming on here. Thanks for for um, I don't even know what to, I'm going to call this segment. I. I I don't know if I get in trouble if I call it Let's Get Deep because that's the name of this game. So. Yeah, I don't know. The way things are these days, you may not want to do that. <laughs> All right. Well, I was like, uh, well, thanks for coming on this YouTube segment called Questions. How about that? All right. Sounds good. Yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Sam. Thanks.